Hello again, ladies and gentlemen. I don't want to end the playthrough with the defeat, so I'm starting again. This time we have this guy, we're gonna call him Alexei. He has special ability. Uh, when I do a command action, I can move up to two Soviet units. He has less uh, supplies, but more health. So we're gonna see how that's gonna work. I decided to start from Sector C and uh, let's shuffle these decks before we go everything is set up let's just go into the game so start of the day German activation you draw three cards and activate German units first column A reinforce one so here we get one German unit then we have a Sector F retreat, oh, so this guy actually retreat back to their command post, okay. And lastly, we have the offensive. So offensive means that all the units are going to move, but only one of them. So it's going to be like this. So from each sector, one unit is going to move forward. They move in columns to, toward the nearest uh, Soviet headquarters. So it's going to be like this. Okay, so a little offensive here on all fronts. Alright, then the battle phase. We have battle here and here. Now this is dangerous, but we'll see how it's going to go. Here they kill each other. So both dead but no change I mean sector started as a, as a Soviet control nothing in, inside so it's gonna stay Soviet control let's see what happens here <laughs> they also kill each other so lots of casualties but no change in the headquarters okay that's good Okay, so that was the battle phase. Now we have the actions. So I have only two supplies. I will resupply in the end of the day. But I'm thinking not to do much right now. Uh, gonna spend one supply. My first thing is gonna be I'm gonna try to do a, a reinforcement. So, I can do it to, I have to be either adjacent or on the Soviet headquarters to do that. So I can reinforce here or here. Well, let's try that. I need a 5 or 6 to get one Soviet units on the board. Nope. Alright, my second action. Uh, I'm actually thinking to shoot here. Now, <clears throat> I can do that. But when calculating the distance, I have to uh, count every orthogonally adjacent card. So this will be 1, 2. So whatever this is, and whatever I draw, I have to shoot. It's not like reconnaissance. With reconnaissance, you draw your targets, and then you decide, do you want to shoot, or do you want to skip some of them? But if you're sh just shooting like this, like straight up, you draw a target, and you have to shoot. You have to spend an action to shoot. Alright, so it's going to be distance 2. Let's just go. First target of the day is a lone soldier. Alright, so he likes to hide in the rubble. But this here is actually fortified, so he doesn't get bonus from that. But the distance is going to give plus 2 to his strength. So he's 6 to kill. I think I'm just gonna roll two dice and I'm not gonna add focus so let's see what the position is in today he's moving so I have minus one to my shot so basically I need if I roll a seven it's not enough actually it's it is enough so it's gonna go to six so seven or more on two dice come on taking a shot yeah that's eight more than enough he's dead first casualty of the day so this unit is gonna retreat now let's see what happens 
also. So roll 2d6 dice, use their difference to receive that much supply of ammo. Okay, that's actually good. I need more supplies. Okay, uh -huh. okay. if I roll a doubles, I receive one supply and one ammo. Alright, so I'm back to two with my supplies. That's good. So I can do another action. Uh, I'm thinking to do the same. Oh, actually... Uh, okay, we're gonna do something different. I'm gonna spend one supply, get two actions. With my first action is gonna move. With my second action, I'm gonna try to reinforce here. So let's try that. Five or six. Come on, guys. No. No, it's not easy to get the reinforcements on across the river. All right, I'm not gonna do any more actions. I'm gonna stay here. Now, since I'm ending my turn on the space with the supply, I can roll a die. And if I get a 5 or 6, I can actually get the supply. Come on. Oh, yeah. Get 2 supply. And that was all my actions. We check do we have the event. No, the top card is target, so no event for today. We do resupply. I roll 2 dice. And the difference is how many supply or ammo I get. Ooh, that's gonna be 4. Alright, let's do this. I don't need any more ammo. I'm just gonna put all four into supply. So this will go to six. So I'm gonna have a lot of action during the night. And that's something I like. Okay. We go into the night. Soviet activation. They activate only two times, so let's see what the Soviets do. Column A reinforce three. Ooh, this is good. So this is column A, this is headquarters in that column, so we get three Soviet units here. And that's good, because remember my special ability, I can command up to two, I can actually push these units around and maybe take take the Stalingrad tonight, we'll see. Okay, second activation, column H advance, uh, that's gonna be here, but no one here to advance, so nothing happens. Uh, okay, battle phase, no battles because no units sharing the same sector, players actions, okay let's do some actions, so I'm gonna spend one supply, I get two actions, I can move up to two Soviet, two Soviet troops, so I'm gonna move these two here, my second action, I'm gonna move only one here, one guy here, okay so we are spread out, so we are fine, that's my two actions, I just commanded some troops. Okay, let's do some more actions. Spend another supply. And I think I'm gonna move in here. And let's do some reconnaissance. Uh, no, I'm, I'm gonna shoot here. Without reconnaissance, just shooting. So let's see the target. Squad leader. Okay. So fortification, no fortification. This is like a clear space. Alright. So, since there is a distance, it's going to be 6 to kill him. Okay, I'm just going to go with 2 dice. Now, let's see which, which position he's in. Oh, target fully exposed, so he's just 6 to kill. Let's go. Oof. Okay, I can spend an ammo to reroll 1 die, but I need a 5 or 6. Yeah, let's go with that. Spending ammo. Come on. Five or six. Otherwise, it's gonna be miss and he's gonna retaliate. Oh, yeah. That's a six. He's dead. First of all, German morale is gonna go down by two. So, 16. Second thing. This will retreat. And, sadly, there are no more units there because I can retreat another German unit from the target sector. So, But, it was the only unit there. Alright, not bad. Oh, by the way, totally forgot. When I was shooting Lone Soldier, my alert should go to 2 because sound wasn't suppressed. But for this guy, sound was suppressed. So my alert stays as it is. Alright, not a bad deal. Do I want to do something else? 
I'm thinking I can call for reinforcement, but from this position... Oh, no, actually I can't. I have to be on headquarters. I have to go back and then call. Uh, that's too many actions. Mm. Oh, I can command. I can push this guy up and take this sector. Yeah, let's do that. Spending supply, getting two actions. First action, command. So I can move up to two troops. Oh, actually, let's do like this. Uh, here's the thing, though. This is my position, so I can command any unit that are uh, orthogonally adjacent. So I can do only this guy here. I can't do these guys or these guys. So that's kind of bummer. But it's okay. It's okay. Uh, I wasn't planning that. Uh, it wasn't a good plan, but at least I'm going to get this unit here. Now we check. No Germans. So this goes to the Soviet side. This unit just retake the center. Alright, that's good. My second action, I think. Oh, there's a lots of target here. But if I just shoot blindly, I don't know. Here's the thing: if I kill something here, and the unit needs to reinforce, they reinforce out of the Stalingrad. So that's how you can actually remove these German units. And I don't like this. I mean, it's four against two. Maybe if they advance, I don't know. Or maybe try to kill... No, I, I'm going to shoot here. I'm shooting here. Oh, wait. Uh, first card event. Second card target. Okay, let's see. Grenadier. Okay, rubble. There is rubble there. So he has a plus one to strength and dist distance plus one. So he's six to kill. Uh, I'm not going to add the focus die. So I'm going to have the reroll. Let's see the position. Target lost, failed. Damn. Just move out and lost that target. Alright, I'm not doing any more actions. I'm going to keep this for the second day. So that's it. Event. No event. Uh, I can lower alert. I'm not going to do that. My alert is only 2 right now. It's fine. So that's it. Let's do another round. We go to the day. Second day in Stalingrad. German activation. They still activate 3 times. So let's see. Sector E is going to retreat. No one there. So nothing happens. Offensive. Alright. So... Every unit from each sector, every one unit from each sector is going to move forward. So this will move forward, this will move forward, this will move forward, and this. So the good news is only one unit is moving. Uh, the bad news is whenever the Germans enter my sector, I need to test my alert. And it goes, right now it's two plus any German unit, so it's two, it's three. So I need uh, three or more to not fail. Four, I'm fine. If I fail, I roll 1d6 for any German unit there. And if they, if they get five or six, I, I lose health. They shoot at me. All right, that's it. Uh, Battles. Yeah, that was... Was that uh, last? No, that was the second. That was the second activation, I think. Yeah, one more. Uh, column age advance so this guy is gonna move in here all right so now it's interesting because two people with my I need four or more right now and I have minus one to alert test uh, I will still succeed with the last roll so it's good during the day minus one so it's a five with the minus one it's a four I'm fine they didn't spot me all right and that was all the activations and now we do battles. We have a battle here, battle here, and that's it. Only two battles. So let's resolve this one. I don't like this one. This sector actually can go to Germans right now. Oh, no. Comrades have killed this German unit. Destroyed. Here we have two Germans and one Soviet unit. 
and one German unit dead, one Soviet unit dead, and this sector goes to Germans. They took it back. Hmm. All right. Well, it happens. So that was the battle. Player sections. All right. Shooting here for sure. So I'm gonna spend one uh, one supply. Got two actions. First action shooting that guy there. Oh, it's a German officer. Oh, but he's in the. There is a fortification here, so he's plus two, so he's seven. Seven to kill. I think I'm gonna. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna spend ammo. I'm gonna use a focus die with my other dice, but let's see what's his position. Oh no, I was afraid of this. He just moved out from my sight. Wow, no. I lost an ammo. Or okay, I'm gonna do it again. I mean, I I have a I have a second action. I have a second action. Let's see. Target grenadier. So he's only four. That's nice. Not gonna spend an ammo. Let's see his position. Fully exposed, plus one to shot. He's dead. He's dead. Yep. Okay, so morale goes down by one. This retreats. Oops. This retreats. Roll a d6 and gain one supply, one ammo. Okay, come on. I need uh, five or six. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's get the supply. Let's get the supply. Oh, by the way, the previous shot, my alert goes to 3. And for this shot also, since there is no suppression, my alert goes to 4. So my alert is pretty high right now. Alright, so let's, uh, let's do another supply. Yeah, let's go to 2. Let's do a... Let's move back and let's try to. Let's do a command. Let's push these guys up. Okay. So, during next battle phase, when we have to resolve the battle, oh, by the way, we resolve this immediately, this will flip to Soviet sides. But during next battle phase, there are going to be battle here. Battle only happens during the battle phase, so you can capture like this, like just push your people there and if you have more people it just captures so that's actually good all right so that's it that's all that I'm gonna do do we have the event no event we go to resupply oh but first I'm on a space where I can actually get more supply come on five or six no and then standard resupply all right that's three so I'm gonna take gonna take two supplies and one ammo. Let's do it like that. And that is that for the day. Let's go into the night. Alright, so now the Soviet activation. Let's see. Two oh, by the way, I totally forgot I should increase the morale, but we took one, then we lost one, so we took another one, so we actually here. So whenever you get the sector, you increase morale of your troops. In any case, we German are doing the offensive, so this will push up, push up, push up. Oh, damn! They could actually retake that. We'll see how the battle is gonna go. Column G reinforced two, so they get two units here, and. Uh, Sector D regroup. Okay, no one in Sector D. Now, if there was one German, at least one German unit here, or more, anything adjacent to that sector would actually move there. So this guy would move, this guy would move, this guy would move. So basically, they just regroup, they fill in the sector, and then, you know, when they push, they can probably, you know, capture something. Oh, but 
no regrouping in that sector so that's it wait what am I doing it's a night phase oh my god let's take this back that was the three cards one two three so this one is actually still on top these two are resolved okay let's go back a bit sorry guys sometimes I I get confused and it's a Soviet activation not a German activation so <laughs> let's do the first card so sector D regroup well basically not I mean that's the second card this was the first one column G reinforced two. so in this column we get two more Soviet troops all right so that was the first this one the second all right sorry about that totally forgot it's it's a night phase uh, battles we have a battle here two Soviets against one German unit come on yeah that German unit is completely destroyed and we keep the sector which is important all right players actions during the night there is a special action that you can do for free you may spend one supply to lower your life by one so I'm thinking I'm gonna it's costly but I don't know I wanna I wanna do lots of things this night so no I'm gonna spend supply get two actions uh, I'm gonna try to reinforce yeah let's try that no second action commanding here so these two guys gonna move up we check who we have more we have Soviets more so this goes to German so that was my two actions then I'm gonna spend another one I'm gonna move here and I'm gonna actually target yeah I wanna target this guy and if he dies and nothing spawns here we can push up and take this command and then I can maybe from from this position command them here yeah I think that's the best option I need to help them out I'm gonna shoot at this let's see what it is German officer mm. Now we're talking. All right, there is no fortified positions there, so he only get plus one from the distance. So he's six. Uh, uh. Okay, it's night. I already have one target lost. Let's hope I'm not gonna get another one. But I will spend ammo to get the focus die. I really want this kill. Let's see the position. Okay, he's moving minus two to shoot. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. I have three dice. Should be a kill. So he's six. I have eight. Minus two, it's six. He's dead. Finally, got one of the officers. Okay, morale goes down by three. All the way to twelve. Wow, that's th this is huge. And by the way shot was suppressed so no no alert this retreats all right and that's it I'm not I'm gonna save these two supplies for a day so let's check this uh, event do we have the oh we have the event let's see what happens during this night in the makeshift shelter you have find some abandoned children but someone has left them box of rations so I'm Number one, you take all the rations, death to their pleats, gain three supplies. <laughs> Tempting. Uh, you decide to lead them toward the friendly lines. Test alert. If you fail, you're ambushed. All of the children have been killed and you lose two health. Okay, let's. it's, it's night, so I have a plus one to alert rolls. Uh, it would be four or more on two dice with a plus one but but something I mean the ruthless part of me is telling me get those supplies for a day and uh, 
I mean, we <laughs> there was a sacrifice in Stalingrad. I mean, children, I'm sorry, but I think I'm gonna take those supplies. So I go straight to five. Yeah, we have to, you know, have to be, have to have to go one step further to win. All right, and now I'm gonna actually <laughs> spend one supply. <laughs> To lower the alert from three uh, from from four to three. Uh, where am I? Uh, if you're on a Soviet head location, uh, yeah, I'm not. All right, so that's only okay. Actually, I want I want to do another round. I, I, I'm kind of hyped for, for this game. I really like it. So I'm gonna do another round. It's gonna be a long video, but lo, lo, but let's go. Let's go. German activation. All right. So let's see what the Germans do. They still have three activations though. So column H, yeah, I, or I don't know how to spell. Column A, reinforced two. Oof, we got two more units here. Okay, so this part here is now dangerous. Five units there. Then, column G advance. Forward. And sector E retreats, no, nothing in sector E, so that's it. Do we have battles? We have one battle here, two Soviet units against one German unit. Oof, but the Germans this time killed one Soviet. It's even, so nothing changes with the sector. Alright. Damn, that kill there, that was nice. Players actions. I kind of I need to do some command I'm gonna spend my supply get two actions I'm gonna command now this is a big risk but I just need some sectors here I'm gonna push this guy here but I'm gonna so I can command to anything that is adjacent right so I can't push this guy, he's engaged in fight. So whenever you have a Germ one German, like if, if this was the situation, okay? So these two are engaged, this one is free to go. All right, I'm thinking it's a big risk, but I'm thinking also to push this guy here. Yeah, I'm gonna do it. So that was my first action. This sector is gonna turn to Soviet side. Wow, we, we 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 pushing Germans, but this sector here is is dangerous. But I have some I have some uh, plans. And then, okay, I'm gonna move in here. That's my second action. I wanna get closer and maybe clear this out. But the problem is, the moment I move, I need to test my alert. It's three plus one unit, so four. I do have minus one to it during day, so I need five or more. Okay, I'm fine. He's not shooting. All right, let's spend another supply and let's do some shooting. But I'm gonna shoot only here, and it's gonna be blind shot without without any reconnaissance. I don't wanna just you know lose. So let's see, one target basically. Elite sniper. Okay, rubble. There is a rubble here, so that's plus one and distance plus one. So he's eight. He's eight. The good news with the reconnaissance is, um, like, you can choose your target. But right now, this is this is what I have to do. Eight. Uh, how many cards? Oh, I need to reshuffle this. But before I do that, yeah, I'm gonna spend an ammo to get the focus die. Let's go three dice and let's see his position. Minus two to shot. So I can wait and draw another card. It's a big risk, but I think I'm gonna do it. 
Ooh, fully exposed. Plus one to shot. Okay. Risk paid out. All right. Yeah, he's completely dead. Morale goes by two. Uh, since I was shooting here, one unit retreats out of the Stalingrad. And uh, D6, I roll a D6. If I get a 5, 4, or 6, I can choose one supply or one ammo. Ah, damn. Alright. Second action, same thing, shooting here. German officer. Ooh, he's in rubble, so he's 6. And the distance he's seven. Oh, I kind of want to spend my luck, but seven, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna spend my last ammo. I'm gonna spend my last ammo to other focus die. Come on, please, something good. Okay, minus one to shot. That's okay. So he's seven to kill with the minus one to roll. No, <laughs> all right. So so this is a six. Damn. I don't have any pluses to that, so I miss. What will happen is he's gonna retaliate, so his shield's gonna go by two, and his his strength's gonna go by plus two. So there will be some shooting involved right now. So he's gonna roll four dice. Oh, by the way, the shot is hurt, so this goes to four. And let's see, yeah. Okay, let's let's roll his uh, his shooting at me. Oh, I take two wounds. Go two. What a disaster! So I can continue shooting at him if I want to. The problem is he's now plus two shield, and with the rubble and the distance, he's basically nine, and that's kind of impossible without the focus die. I mean, I would need really good roll. So I'm gonna choose not to shoot again. So he goes away. Damn! What a what what a disaster right now. All right, let's stop there. Let's go. Let's see. So actions phase event. Do we have the event? No, there is no event for the day. Resupply. Okay. Uh, this phase doesn't give me anything basically. So just rolling for two dice and okay. Uh, gonna take supply. And that was that. We go into the night, and with the night we're gonna finish this video. All right. So no ammo. Very low with the supply. Pretty hurt. But Soviet activation. So let's see what our comrades do. Sector D regroup, so there is a unit there. So this guy is gonna move in, this guy is gonna move in, and this guy is gonna move in. They all regroup there, nice. Well, if they push, that, that's gonna be huge. Uh, and by the way, uh, we have, we, I, I captured two more sectors, I, the morale should be here. And I need to watch for this. Okay, then column G reinforce three. Uh, this is column G. We get reinforced three here. Ooh. Wow, this gives us an options. I might go for the complete capture of Stalingrad win. We'll see. Okay, then we do battles. There is only one battle, it's gonna happen here. Four Soviet units against one German. Uh, one Soviet unit destroyed, one German destroyed. I like it. I mean, it would be better if our comrade didn't die, but 
happens. Player's actions. So I have three actions. I kind of want to command, but I need to get closer. So I'm going to spend first action. Uh, I'm going to move here because I have to move. I can only command adjacent. And second action command to these two guys here. We check only service there. This command post is taken. Now, here's the thing it's still active, so they can still reinforce here. But if I manage to take this one, I mean, if, we, if I push with these guys and then manage to take this one, it's going to be a good win. The only problem is we have lots of sectors without any Soviets. We are all in the, in, on the, this part of the map. Alright, I'm, uh, I'm actually thinking not to do any more actions. Just to skip. So, to see what can I do during a day. I mean, I'm very, very low with the supplies. So, let's see. Event. Oh, we do, we're going to have the event. After a night of constant bombardment, some civilians have left their shelters to try to evacuate outside of the city. So, one, you stop them and do a quick search, taking all of the rations. Gain two supply, but my alert goes plus one. Or you provide a cover for them as they move down the streets. You may perform one free command action, but alert goes. I'm going to do command action. Yeah, let's do that. So one free command action, and I actually can command two units. So let's do it like this. Uh, let's move this guy here. And let's move this guy here. Now, why I did that is I, I, I want to keep this sector. So if they reinforce, they're going to be battle. Maybe we're going to win. Uh, all right. But my alert goes to five. Oof, that's a high alert. And I'm in a bad position there. Okay, I'm not going to lower the alert. I need my supplies. So that's going to be that. I'm going to put this in the day, but we're going to stop video here. Uh, did I push the morale when I took this? No, I, I forgot again. So morale should actually be here. Uh, so far, so good. I mean, we retake so much of the Stalingrad. that the only thing that bothers me is this sector here. If they do the offensive or advancement, it's you know they're gonna take this, and then it's gonna be a game of trying to catch them up. Although if they if they go outside of this position, I can push all the way and capture all these command posts. But we'll see, we'll see, we'll see next video what the Germans gonna do. Uh, deck is still fine. I still have time, and. I need to push their morale to here, to 6, when the deck reshuffles, otherwise I just lose the game. So I need to push morale a, bit, a little bit, but I'm so low on supplies. I don't think I'm going to do anything during the night. I would have to really do a good resupply and then to maybe do something during the, I mean during the day, maybe do something during the night, we'll see. In any case, thanks for watching. This is Sniper Stalingrad 1942, and it's a it's a very very interesting game. So, see you in the next video.